Well, with the countdown on to the general election, the Free National Movement has named more candidates to run on its ticket. Last evening, two more Family Island candidates were ratified. And as Altavis Munning tells us tonight, they are newcomers to frontline politics. They will all listen to the people. Yes. Yes. And they will speak for the people. Yes. Surrounded by the majority of the party's general election candidates, Free National Movement leader Dr. Hubert Minnis confirmed at a special council meeting Wednesday night that 29 candidates have officially been ratified to represent the party in this year's general election. He describes them as the change candidates who will be moving the party's change agenda forward. 28-year-old Navarro Bull will represent the FNM for his homeland of Exuma. The technological entrepreneur wasn't present at Wednesday night's meeting, but Dr. Menace is very confident he will win that constituency. Reverend Miriam Emanuel of Good Samaritan Kingdom Ministries on Gadet Avenue off Carmichael Road has been ratified to represent the opposition in her native Michael constituency, replacing former candidate Walt Saunders. f and we don't die. No. We just multiply. Yeah. Reverend Emmanuel made it clear that her initial entry into frontline politics is an assignment from God, as she desires to be a nation builder for Bahamians everywhere. I remember when I started college, and my two choices was um, political science and law, because I envisioned myself being a lawyer and also assisting with the country. I love politics, and as a woman, I feel that I brought a lot, will bring a lot to the table. Women can now look at me and say, guess what? I can do it. The sky is not the limit. And don't allow anybody to tell you that you can't. Before ending his press conference Wednesday night, Dr. Minnis issued this challenge to his party. You must register. Encourage each and every member of your family and friends to register. Let us see hundreds of people going forth this week to register. Alta Viz Munnings, ZNS Network News.